From News 7 KWWL, this is Breaking News. We are still following a breaking news out of Lamont this morning. The Dubuque County Sheriff's Office is investigating a woman's death. Good morning. It is 6.32. I am Ryan Wittree. And I'm Katie Easter on this Thursday morning. KWWL's Lily Cedardall is live with us in studio this morning and tells us what we've learned in the last half hour, Lily. Yeah, well, we haven't learned too much new information in our last half hour, but what I can tell you is that Dubuque County Sheriff's deputies did respond to a report of unresponsive person in Lamont last night. When they got to the home, they found a dead woman, and after investigation, officials believe that woman was killed. The Iowa woman was found to have two children, a 13-year-old and a 5-month-old. Neither of the children were found at the home during the initial investigation. This is when authorities learned that the five-month-old was turned over to a random address in Wisconsin. According to Sheriff Joe Kennedy, the person of interest was found driving through Dane County, Wisconsin. Law enforcement there tried to stop them. Eventually, two people ran out of the car. The missing 13-year-old was later found dead by unknown causes. The five-month-old was found alive at a house in Wisconsin. Sheriff Kennedy is not identifying the person of interest, but says they are barricaded inside a house in Dane County. Now officials are on alert as they warn people to stay inside. The Albion Sheriff's Department confirms that they are negotiating with an armed man and woman inside a house. They were last seen walking around with a rifle and a handgun. As of about five hours ago, a person of interest was barricaded inside a Dane County home, and it's believed that the man barricading himself is indeed the same man Dubuque County is looking for. Now, I do want to reiterate, we do not know if these two stories are indeed related. Of course, we will keep you updated once we learn more. Ryan and Katie, 